Hey everybody, how's everybody doing? This is Rodman. Gonna bring you guys another video on the program that I use for my stock scanning TC2000. So anyways, um, this is a nice program. I love it. It's what I can afford. It's an awesome program and I'm gonna pump you out a lot more videos. Gonna show you guys a layout that I use when I'm doing my day trading. And it's strictly stocks that I get set up the next month. So when the market opens up, everything's ready to go. And I'm going to show you guys how I set that layout out. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to click on the little bottom button here. And um, go in here to explain a little bit about <coughs> this. It's, and I got a cold, by the way. I apologize. I Get a little nervous too. But anyways, so what one we're gonna go with first, and I recommend we can do it this way. It really doesn't matter. But what we're gonna do is obviously we're gonna um go to double. In fact, we're probably gonna make a couple of these. Probably gonna do three of these. Um. So I'm gonna do one more here. All right, and we're gonna do um, one up top. All right, and now other one we can put here. It doesn't matter or we can get rid of it because we can just do a split here. Gives us two uniform ones and we're gonna do this here. And let's put these. Gonna do these. So all we have to do is just bring them up a little bit. Once we get them up, we can kind of uh, chop them in and <coughs> get them lined up right. Now this is for obviously we can bring these up to where we want, depending on how big we want to get, what we want to do. That's nothing. Um, and next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna lay out the chart. So basically. Um, give you an example. <clears throat> I'm going to come down here, look for the chart I want, which is right here. Now, all right, boom, what do I want to do? No big deal. I don't want that chart. Just come up here and we'll, we'll find one that we want. We want a black chart. All right. So what we're going to do is I'm just going to make a ton of these duplicates. You're going to go bam. Bam, 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 and you're just going to go bam, and you're just going to, you're going to put them right here, it says boom, all right, and this is what we're going to do, <coughs> all right, same thing, I'm just going to come in, make a do, bam, So obviously you just close out the window here. But basically all we're gonna do is just go up top here, S E X. Wrong one. All right, it's easy, just go to color. I'm just trying to show you guys a fast way to do this. Basically it's just black and, and done. So I'm just gonna go up here, open up another chart, and I'm just gonna go with black, and then I'm gonna make a few more of them. Just hit du by hitting duplicate, we just make a bunch of them. All right, it's no big deal. All right, and these are the ones, I remind you, I have all these set up in the morning, so when I'm ready to go for my stocks, I have them already up in the morning to where it's like, there's no big deal. And then, of course, you just want to get rid of this. Or you could put a scan up there. It really doesn't matter. Like, <clears throat> all that. But I'm not going to show you that for now. Because you guys already have it. I'm just going to show you what I use to day trade with. Uh, this is what I'm doing. So we got this. And, of course, we can um, 
put a column here, we put one here, all right, um, and then I'm going to put another one here, because I like to do three columns, pretty much so, actually I do four up top, so we can actually do four columns up top, but it's too much, so I just like to get rid of one right here. See, I just like that idea. So I can kind of watch three columns, pretty much. So this is a chart I use for my um, minutes. <coughs> and um, like that. So usually what I'll do is I'll just like... I mean, you just... You just click it once, go back, click it once, go back. That's how you remove it. You know what I mean? And then you want to go in and you set it for, a, like, I like a big chop one minute. <clears throat> I like the three minute on these shots. And then I do the five minute. Oh, like five minute on this shot. And then, like I'm saying, you have a different ways you can set it up. But with me, I want to do, um, I want a better view. So I'm going to set it. This is another way. Most people like to set it up that way. But I usually keep these on the one minute chart. And um, what we'll do is you keep it on the one minute chart. And I can have six stocks. And if I want to bring it down short, bring it up whatever I want if I want to bring it there like I'm saying if you're doing good but I kind of like it like that because I really can get a good aerial of the shot by zooming in so I mean this is what I like hopefully you guys are like this is a really cool layout and like I said this is what I use when I get up in the morning and before I'm doing anything I'm putting all my symbols in there so I, I show you a quick way to do things. And usually another quick way too, if you wanted to, <coughs> it's no big deal. But all the colors are organized. So I like doing it this way because how I set my charts up is that if all these bot bottom ones stay the same and I'll put a different number in them. Like I'll put one for, um, like, and I'll just click no color. Because I don't want them to, they're going to be different stocks. So you would just click no color and you can have uh, HDMI, this one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. You know what I mean? To, to give you an example. So like I'll do is I'll, I'll come in and give you an example of what stocks I'm going to be watching tomorrow. It's going to be very simple. In fact, I, but anyways, <clears throat> you just get a watch list. Um. Uh, and I'll just show you what I'm talking about. I'll get the NASDAQ ones. So right now what we could do, and you do it quickly. What I do during the day, if I want to put it in, I'll just shrink up. I got a dual monitor, so I actually um, make a float. But um, I'll show you a float. You go down here to float, and you can float the window to another screen. <coughs> And then what you could do is you go red and you set all the different colors red and you can go down and this is what I do to get my colors in quick because it's like bam, bam, boom, 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 boom. And then once you get them in, you just change the colors back to blue so you can get the hourly chart. Because once they're set up, they're all going to be in blue. So then you go purple. I'll show you guys. Um, violet. No, I already got violet. I'm sorry. It's going to be teal. <coughs> and then brown. So now I'll come over here. And the first one I'm going to do is the blue one. So the blue one's going to be this one. All right. And I'll come over here. I'll change the color. I'll go to red. And that one's going to be red. And 
and then if I want to see what stock I'm watching, I can see it up here. Then I'll go across, change that one to orange. It just goes a lot easier if I can do that. And then I'll put orange to that one. So I got my orange one. So you got the different ones. I got boom, 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 boom. P, P, V, and Yeah, and now I'll come over here. Look, I'll go to my next list. You just change the preference list, and then you type in, do, this is what I do for the market. So I'm watching Nokia here. You're just changing the colors. And the next one's going to be Sprint. I'm going to do the teal one next. Chuckstone Energy. <coughs> got the uh all right so i got some of these now um <coughs> so i got these three all set up right so now say if i'm watching these three stocks well okay i got <coughs> i got more i want to do i want to obviously do one more like i'm saying you can either shrink it up or if I got two more stocks to watch, I can easily come over. What I like about this, it's so fast to bounce something out. But this is what I do. And then what I do <coughs> is I'll show you. You can have, and they're all on the one minute chart. So if I want them all on the one minute chart, I want to see what they're doing on the one minute chart. I'm just going to put everything on the one minute chart. <coughs> and I'm done. So in other words, if I want this one to be up there, I can just take the color off, but link them to all of them. So basically, if I want to see this on the one minute chart, I would just go to blue and blue. If I want to see it on the... If I want to see, um, I want to see this one, this one, I just go blue. If I want to see a different color. So say if I want to see the orange, I just drop down and I click on orange and I got orange. So basically just a matter of color code. I just go to blue. I just go to red if I want to see the red. So this is a good way that I like to work on the stocks. All right. So this is how I do my layouts. This is what I do when I'm working in the morning, the 15 minutes. I can see the chart. I can come in. If I want to go to the 30 minute chart, I got it up here, the five minute. If I want the daily, it's just a matter of dropping down and hitting the daily. Bingo. And then I can see it. You know what I mean? <clears throat> you can get rid of one. Like if I want to, I could just blow this one apart or shrink it. So it's all what you want to do here. You know what I mean? It's all personal preference. So, hope this guy really, this gives you guys a lot because this is what I like to use when I'm trading my stocks. I can see what's going on here. I can zoom in, hit the daily. If I want to do the daily chart for a quick minute, I can just go daily and then I can zoom in here and see what's going on. So, this is really a good layout if you're going to be doing a lot of day trading. 
and you want to watch a bunch of stocks, you know what I mean? I got six 32-inch monitors, three on the bottom, three on the top, <coughs> two more on the side. Next layer I'm going to show you is going to be my big one. So I'm going to finish up this. If you guys have any questions, please just send me a, hit me up on, on YouTube and I'll answer your questions. I'm going to bang out another one. All right. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Hope this YouTube video, TC2000, awesome program. Definitely check it out. Amen.